but there are many types of pre-trained models available. There are pre-trained image recognition models, which are extremely good for image classification. Then there are pre-trained object detection models, which can be used to identify specific objects within images. And then, of course, there are pre-trained language models, which can be used for natural language processing, as well as classification tasks such as sentiment analysis. Up until now, we have focused only on LLMs. However, when looking at pre-trained models, we decided to expand the horizon and look at other types of models as well. And so we decided to also work with image recognition models. The reason for this is twofold. First, while we decision scientists most commonly work with tabular data, image data is all around us. In order to, and in order to harness that information, it is important to be able to work with image models. Secondly, image-based models are very good at identifying patterns in images. So by converting tabular data into images, we can potentially extract complex relationships between features that might be harder to capture with traditional tabular learning methods.